He's ready for more shinies. Some shiny shinies. So we just got the third gym badge. So we're just gonna keep rolling through the game. Oh, we have to go talk to the lady and do the dumb Lucario thing. If the Lucario's not shiny, we're not keeping it. In the last attempt that I did this, her Mega Lucario got a crit and I lost this battle. But it doesn't matter because it's not like you're using actual Pokemon, you know? Don't do it. Nice. We win. Shool. No, I don't want it. It's not shiny. Gross. Ew. Ew. Ew, get out of here. Stay there forever, little Lucario. I want to, where do you get low sweep? Is it from here? It is, thank you. Okay, cool, don't have to check all the other places. That's super chill. All right, Serena, come give me surf, please, so that we can travel the waters. We can also teach that to uh, Mr. Frog, Frogman. Got our froggy, froggy frogadier here. Water pulse is fine here. So, we can get a, we can get a shiny here if we want. Do I have Pokeballs? I'm lazy. What's the rule set and gimmick for this run? Don't be lazy. Uh, we only have seven Great Balls. That should be fine. Are the rivals from Pokemon X and Y as dull as people say they are? No, they're duller. Uh, yeah, they suck. Shiny Lepra. Ooh, I could try for Shiny Lepra. Let's let's check. Do I need to have only five Pokemon in party? All right, let's see if we get Shiny Lapras. Although because we have Frogadier, I don't know if it's worth it. Let's try. I'll re-nickname it if it's Shiny. What's your favorite post game in Pokemon? Um, I don't play too many of the post games. I would probably say uh it's not shiny so we're throwing that away i would probably say sword and shield is my favorite post game just because it's the most time i've played into it like i do and it's really easy to do competitive battles on that because you can get so many of the items that you need and everything bye bye lepra so let's see what we get instead Beedrill Solo Elite Four. Is that possible? I don't know. I feel like the fire type would be kind of hard. Manifesting a shiny Tauros. That is my favorite mon of all time. All right. Fingers crossed. We got this shiny Tauros right here. Nope. Did you turn the new shiny raid on? You know, I actually didn't. <laughs> I just realized, yeah, I loaded the wrong thing. All right, we're back. It's fine. I kind of, I just, I forget that they use the same location to save the thing. So you can technically play either. It's kind of weird. I'm glad there's no like glitches. All right, now it's going to be a shiny right here. Darn it. Ah, oh, damn it. It's a win goal. That's lame. So retry on Lapras too late. I already saved. Uh, I don't want a win goal. This thing doesn't have hydration in this game, right? Wow. Supersonic. Uh, yeah. No, Drizzle is its normal ability in at least uh, Sword and Shield, right? Isn't it? Funnily enough, Shiny Wingle was one of my very first full odd shiny. That's crazy. I just got a full odd shiny wingle. That's awesome. Alright, let's let's catch this guy. Call it Malachite. Oh right, I gotta get my shiny gems gempundit.com. No, that wasn't it, was it? Alright. First shiny for me was an electrode. It was one of the electrodes in New Vaudeville plant, and the one next to it was the Master Ball. Wow. Ooh, Peridot's pretty nice. I don't know if... Ah, uh, Peridot's a much closer color. Yeah, Peridot is better. Let's do Peridot. It's got keen eyes, so even if this Pelipper does have drizzle, this one won't. Plus speed, minus defense. Dog. Wow. All right, whatever. I'm staying in the box, buddy. Oh, it's the best part of the game right here, baby. Wake up, sir. Mm. Do 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 How long would I have to ride this skiddo for my viewer count to drop to below 50? Like how long would you watch me do this? Three hours? If I did this for three hours, you think I feel like people I don't know. Depends how you frame it. What if I frame it like this? I'm gonna do this for three hours. 30 minutes. Skidoo ASMR. You can sleep to that. Can you sleep to this? What if I talked like this? Skiddo writing brought to you by Skillshare.com. What exactly is the theme of this hardcore nuzlocke? Um, it's Skiddo or Skidoo, however you prefer. If you talk like that, I might become a Jedi. <laughs> Oh, like Yoda? But Yoda's a baby. How would that make him? He's not a Jedi yet. Or like Jar Jar. Talk like this, you must. What if I could jump into the sea and this turns into, it's like a car that turns into a boat. All right. I think we can move on. Just kidding. We're continuing the Skiddo train. Enter warp drive Skiddo. Okay, we're done. You go, goat. <laughs> Let's go to Kumarine City. Um, we could... Oh, God. Oh, I want to battle you in front of the gym because I don't have a life and... Uh... Ooh, we might be able to get Shiny Trap Hinch. 
Wait, let's just go kill this Serena lady first. If you get Flygon, name it Amalite. <gasps> we got him! Shiny little olive trap pinch! Woo, this thing does have rock slide though, so I think I have to switch out. Flygon it is, baby. Last three Kalos runs that I've had, I've used Flygon. All right, let's get him. Get in my belly. One ball! Ah! Okay. I'm concerned this guy will kill me. Who has the Rocky Helmet? All right, let's try one more Pokeball. We'll do one more. Come on, Great Ball. You don't seem that great. Oh, you just had to neg the Great Ball. Okay, cool. Nice. One Ball HG. We got it. All right, what type of uh, Amalite? Malachite. Oh, Amalite's pretty cool. Very dragony. I'm going to do Amalite. Yeah. Amalite HG. All right. Let's take a look at this guy. Oh, he's so cute. Hardy's is solid nature, neutral. Uh, 59 attack, damn. Yeah, I think this is probably fine. This, he's probably got, she's probably got a Pokemon at level 33, right? It's not ideal, but oh, uh, what are you gonna do? Oh man, this music's great though. All right, show me what you got, buddy. Rude. Rude. Nice, nice. Whoa, that's not a lot of damage. Why is this Meow Stick so good? Okay, well, it's not that good. <laughs> it's quick attack kill from here? I'm gonna say yes. Got it. Uh, Absol. Oh, you know what? We should go get Excizor and teach it to Absol. There we go, we can go to Topaz. Okay, uh, Brick Break. Oh, that light screen. Oh my God, that doesn't kill. I feel like I miss out on kills in this game like an aggressive amount of the time. How does that not kill? Wow. Okay, fill it in. We can go to B-roll here, I think. Uh, this thing does have bite, but it shouldn't go for bite. Hello, my fifth favorite streamer. Hello, my 326th favorite follower. Okay, um, let's go and do Twin Needle. Ooh, that is not a lot of damage. Poison? Uh, how much does this do? Should be fine. Come on, poison. There we go. Wow. Big brain needle arm play to get the uh, overgrow and waste my orange berry. Damn. All right, nice. Okay, cool, 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 cool. I want shiny Inky, I've never used Inky, although I don't know how to evolve Inky on this version of the 3DS. Ooh, shiny little guy. Shiny little guy. Sometimes I forget Arizona exists. Rude. Eggs are cute. That's a pretty cool Pokemon. Where do I get a leaf stone in this game? Ha ha ha! Suck it, execute. Great ball. Go! Turn your whole computer upside down? I'm not playing on a com computer. Yeah, it should be fine. Let's go to B drill here. Uh-oh, wait, does this thing have Leech Seed? That's really inconvenient. All right, come on. Thank you. All right. Oh, goodness. All right, here we go. Last Great Ball for all the marbles. So, are you kidding? Are Execute hard to catch? What's going on here? It just takes one ball. One ball HG. Uh, what are we naming this yellow guy? What does Exeggutor look like? Ooh, oh, he's kind of cool. He looks like a like an autumn tree. Citrine? Didn't we are? Don't we already have a citrine? Maybe not. All right. All right. None of these guys are citrine at the very least. Let's see here. So we've got Jump Pluff. We've got Weepin' Bell, which is a gimme, and we've got the Who's My Dang It? The Go Go. All right. So just gotta figure out a way to kill the Jump Pluff, and then Beedrill kind of takes care of the rest. The issue is that the Jump Pluff has acrobatics, which is kind of a good move. You know, a really good way to farm followers on Twitter is to every couple weeks 
just tweet something about Gen 6 and be like, these games are actually good. And then Twitter's like, oh yeah, damn. I'm very bad at using Twitter because like the best way to get a lot of Twitter followers and reactions is to tweet something completely un-unique and really basic. And then people will be like, oh my God, I didn't know that other people in the world also like fruit sometimes. But you can be like, fruit's pretty good. And people will be like, oh yeah, like, 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 like. Um, so we're going with Fletchinder. We're going with this guy and we're going with this guy, right? That was the plan. These three, these three hooligans. All right, Zangoose, don't let me down, chief. So we got Ramos. He's got jump fluff. I did no calcs for this, so this could go really poorly. I guess we'll see. I'm hoping that poison jab is a two shot here and jump fluff doesn't do that much damage, but I could be totally off on this. Do poison jab. Ugh, okay, that's a lot of damage. 39. Never mind, it's a one shot. We're fine. Okay, cool. Is the JoJo gonna come out? Yep. There's Jojo. So the thing is, Jojo might kill us here because Acrobatics did 29 and Acrobatics is 110 and Takedown is 90. Oh, but it's not Stab. Okay, I'm calling your bluff. You're gonna use Bulldoze here anyways, actually, right? So maybe we go Amber because it's gonna use Bulldoze. I'm calling it, we're going Amber. <laughs> All right, I think Aerial Ace is fine here. Honestly, actually Ember might be better. Ooh, that does nothing. Take down. Okay, okay. How much does that do? Oh, All right, is there a way to do this so I don't activate a hyper potion? Probably not. There we go. Okay, it's over. <laughs> My guess is with burn and takedown damage, we will kill. Let's hope. Okay. Oh, nice. That just killed straight up. Wow, high roll. Okay, we're crushing this. We're crushing this. Amber's donezo. Weeping Bale. No reason not to go to Barrel here, I think. I don't think it really matters, but what a rough and difficult gym leader. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. Ow! Ow, that hurt. Weeping Bale? More like Weenie Bale? Ha! Got him! Oh, crap. Come on, let's get a crit here. Crit, crit. Ugh, that's not healing range. Nice, woo! Good job, shiny Beedrill. Good job, Beedrill. I believe. Remember when Beedrill survived with like one HP against the first gym leader? Cool, all right. Were there like literally any doubters? Doubter in shamble? <laughs> yeah, was there even one doubter? The Kalos gym leader should have megas. Hell yeah, mega weeping bell. Absolutely. All right, so now we have to do the hardest part of the game, which is fight that one guy with an acrobatic skull bat. But other than that, it's pretty much a straight shot. Just gotta find a, a Pokemon that has a ground type move. I always doubt because the pay day is so enticing. You know what that's called? A gambling addiction. Oh, you're on the Nuzlocke validation cancel? Are you actually? You should get out of my stream. I don't like that. I think it's stupid. <laughs> uh, okay, well, then we can just do this. I don't know why you're in my stream because you kind of seem like a douchey piece of <laughs> We're just going to ban you. I think that's really dumb. Even if it's a joke, I think it's a real piece of <laughs> move and it's very gatekeepy. And I think it makes it really hard for people who otherwise would have a lot of fun doing hardcore stuff. It makes it really difficult for them to get into it. I think people like that should <laughs> off because it makes the gaming space way more toxic than it already is. And we don't need more toxicity in a community that is really well known for being non-inclusive to people that aren't white men. So hope that guy can <laughs> off. Anyways, let's continue. Shiny Greninja looks really cool though. Look at this guy. I like this a lot. This look, looks even cooler than, I, I thought it was gonna be kind of like the like skin from Smash Bros, but this is way cooler. It's like jet black. I don't actually know who this person is, so I'm not like specifically trying to target them. It's just people that have that type of attitude and I've seen the Nuzlocke Council thing on Twitter. It's got like three followers and yeah, it's just, it's just negativity in a space that does not need negativity. And like, I don't have any patience for that. Uh, cool, let's do it. I think it's a Manetric first and then the Mighty Anna is second, right? I guess we'll find out, huh? Ooh, you know what? Probably should have taught this guy Bulldoze. Oh, it's a Houndoom first. Ugh, is that a problem? Probably not, I don't know. I guess if this burns me, it's a problem. Oh yeah, I forget that like people love physical Houndoom. <laughs> AI loves physical Houndoom. Boom, one shot. Suck it, Houndoom. Yeah. 
How Nim learns it is a bit sad. It doesn't learn special moves until really late. Yeah. Okay. She generously does not fight us back to back. We get a break. I think it might have Intimidate, but I don't think it matters. Yeah. Um, I wonder if two, two still kills. I guess we'll see. Assurance? That should do nothing. Ooh, six damage. Good job. Uh, two shot? Yeah, nice. Oh, you went for roar? Too bad, buddy. Topaz, gotcha. Easy stuff. All right, so that takes care of that. Oh, it's the mass strangers. Gee, I wonder who they are. And we got full restores. Okay, worth it. Thank you. And now we can move on. All right. Which of my lucky Pokemon am I going to bring? So we want to fight the Amolgo with something. We don't have a rock type, damn. Also, Hippowdon's not that good into this gym because the thing has Grass Knight. I guess I could stall it out by switching between these two. Beedrill Solo Sweep for the content. It's got Aerial Ace, right? I always think it has Acrobatics, but it's got Aerial Ace. This thing has decent Spadef, right? And with Morning Sun, it's not terrible. Probably kill Heliolisk with this guy. So I'm thinking uh, this one, this one. We could get the Brock. Lava. Ooh, ooh, what about you? I forgot. I forgot we have you. You're a gross Pokemon. Yeah, we're gonna use you. So let's go get the um alleged, there's an alleged berry somewhere or a leaf stone on Route 8. Is it, where is it? Near the jumping stones? It's over here. Is that it? Is that the leaf stone? Cool. All right, let's do it. Uh, This is probably the hardest gym in the game, I would say. Yeah. All right, here we go. And off we go. Yeah, I don't think this is a super, super hard gym, but it's probably one of the hardest ones in the game because most of the other ones are really easy. I guess it depends on the challenge, obviously, but I think generally. All right, we got our shiny kind of sick pear colored Hippowdon against Emolga here. We're gonna rock tomb once here. It has to use Aerial Ace. I can't imagine it does that much damage. Perfect, easy. Okay, this is fine. Go there. Ooh, that does good damage. That does good damage. Why don't we activate that Hyper Potion, yeah? Hyper Potion? Ah, uh, no, it's just going for another one. Okay, that's fine. Uh, great. So now I imagine the Heliolisk comes out because it has Grass Knot, but we can go straight to Vibrava here. Uh, it's kind of annoying, actually, that Magneton's gonna be last. That's a cool looking quick attack. Okay. Sure. Good, good, good move choice, buddy. Guess it just doesn't want to use Grass Knot. All right. I'm going to use Dig here because I want it to potentially use a Hyper Potion. Dang it. Yeah. Okay. So, um,. That's fine. Okay, so I do think that we're in risk to a mirror shot crit here. So I don't really want to stay in. I think I have to go to Pearl here and we'll see how, what happens. <laughs> all right, all right, Chief. Well, that that's game. Oh, and we're just faster than this Magneton. How is that even possible? How is that possible? Diggersby is a beast. I mean, can't one-shot a Magneton with a stab bulldoze, but yeah, it's a beast, I guess. Cool. I swear Twitch chat does not play Pokemon. They just say words. How did that Magneton live? I mean, Diggersby just sucks. It's got trash attack. Timid Diggersby. I'm pretty sure we're minus speed, too. It's really weird that we outsped there. The future is now. <laughs> This is such a weird character. Yeah, let's, uh, yeah, we are minus speed. Magneton has less than 58 speed. That's kind of shocking. Whatever. Okay, well, that's badge number five. Woo! <laughs> so now the real question is, are we gonna lose a Pokemon to the rival fight that I always lose a Pokemon to? All right, here we go. Pokemon trainer Serena sent out Meow Meow. Meow Meow Beans. Okay, it's gonna fake me out, but whatever. I don't care. Ugh, how much does this do? All right, well, here's hoping this kills or else we're dead. All right, Chestnut. Uh, this is gonna be a random move. 
but we can always just go to Amber here. You would have died to a crit? I don't think so. Bite, how much does this do? Okay, I think we're gonna win this one. Trevor Lock, hard cool rules, but run ends if you win to Trevor. <laughs> All right, that's easy. Yeah, I think you're you're coded to beat Trevor. It just would be cool if maybe you didn't, you know? Is it a big deal if this Swords Dance is here? Maybe, but whatever. What is your recommended Pokemon game to start a Nuzlocke on? Whichever one you know best, or Fire Red and Emerald. Both of those are, are really straightforward. Um, They're good introductions to the franchise and like helps you refine Nuzlocking skills. You've seen zero Pokemon. I lost. I wonder if you can see zero Pokemon. I would guess you can't. You probably can't progress through the game, right? Oh, by the way, that's defeated. Where do you actually get Magnemite in this game now that I think about it? What route is Magnemite on? What gives me the best chance at shiny Gumi? Is it the water or is it the grass? Gumi is 10% in standard walking. Shallow water, Gumi goes to 20%. So I think we do shallow water, which is here, right? There's a Gumi, but it's not shiny. Come on, shiny Gumi. Uh, shiny Gumi is also pretty hard to catch. So maybe we don't want shiny Gumi, but whatever. Ooh, shiny Gumi. Oh, look at his little cheeks. He's so cute. Does Gumi know takedown though? I'm worried Gumi knows takedown. Okay, he doesn't, but he knows flail. So it's kind of scary to do this. Nah, sh Um, it's not great. All right, Zangoonie, I'm willing to risk your life to get shiny Gumi. How much, how much, uh, how much HP does this thing have? At most, it has 78. Uh, so, oh man, I really should have taught this thing detect, huh? All right, it's worth the risk. It's worth the risk. It's a shiny Gumi. I don't really care about Zangoose that much. Come on, shiny Gumi. You got this. Just get in the ball, Gumi. Um, so, I mean, it, it might not kill because it does double damage, right? All right, it's worth it <laughs> for the, <laughs> for the content. <laughs> well, <laughs> <laughs> wait, it's triple damage. All right, peace, Zangoose. I didn't know that. <laughs> Uh, okay. Well, now we now we gotta catch him. <laughs> it's just a Zangoose. All right, Gumi. B be a deer here. Come on, Gumi. Mother... F okay. Um... Probably should have leveled this thing up. Sack the whole team. Did I just give that Gumi a, um, okay, okay. Um, well, well, folks, end of the line. Just, just keep using Bide. Oh, okay, yeah, it's, I mean, it's still a Gumi. Come on. Wow. Yeah, we can use Timer Ball in a couple turns because that'll be more, but I believe this one's getting caught. One Ball HG. Woo! We got it. The weakest dragon type. Totally worth the sack. <laughs> what do we name this monstrosity here? All right, Morganite it is. Morganite it is. Freaking murderer. I guess it kind of looks Morganite-y. R.I.P. Zangoose, huh? All right, Valerie. Let's do it. Make this easy on me, buddy. And let's do it. All right, Mawile. I imagine that this will still do... Like, this won't do that much damage because it's flame charge. So we might have to mess around here a little bit. But let's see how much that does. Oh, what do I know? Oh, it's a crit. Nice. That helps a lot. Just use Iron D. Got the Iron D. How much does Crunch do? Why don't you burn yourself too? Oh, this Talon Flame is such a cheater. Nice. All right, so it's going to waste a, a potion here at least. That's pretty chill, which means we're going to get back to full HP. Good job, Amber. And this should be a two shot. Yep. Nice. Ah, uh, we're not going to get back to full HP. That's okay. 
Val already having her worst day. <laughs> Alright, bring out... Bring out the Mr. Mime. Please and thank you. Yep. So my guess is it's going to go for a uh, reflect here. So we're just going to toxic it. Because <laughs> I'm, I'm a piece of shit. Oh, or it's going to just go for psychic. 116 down to 62. That is... 57 damage yeah so 57 damage crit okay so we're definitely at risk to a crit here i guess i think we can just go citrine i think that's fine i think amber's done we could have just used fly to get some recovery back but i don't think it matters it's also probably going to just go for reflect here yeah i guess i could have roosted right roost was probably actually the play but that's okay let's go ahead and bullet seed i don't want the the recovery yep light screen is fine this is the second turn of reflect see how much this does okay all right, uh, I'm gonna waste a turn here. Actually, that's the third turn. I want Reflect to be gone when I switch into Beedrill. So we can go ahead and let's just waste a turn here. How much does this do? It's a lot. Actually, no, it's not. Uh, 50? Okay, so crit won't kill. Yeah, Hyper Potion is fine. Nice, crit. Hi, Pop. We're doing a gin battle. Hi, honey. No. All right, Reflect's gonna wear off, that's perfect. Uh, it uh, might actually use another Hyper Potion, guess not. Okay, perfect. There goes our Citrus Berry though. <laughs> we got some Poppy Cheers. All right, this should be good then. Reflect is gone now, so Sylveon comes out, likely goes for Dazzling Gleam. We can now go to um, b Rail here. And I hope this doesn't do that much. I actually don't know the calc on this, but Beedrill is relatively specially defensively bulky. We resist this by one at least. Yeah, that does nothing. We are good to go. Thank you for the Black Sludge recovery. Thanks, Beedrill. Light screen's gone. Doesn't matter. I believe Poison Jab will one shot, but maybe not. We'll see. Yeah, not even close. Oh, no. Um, huh. That's pretty annoying. Come on, Beedrill. Yes! Love is dead! Love is dead! Woo! Hi. Woo! All right, that's Valerie defeated. We got it. We got it. Yes, that was a fine battle. I shall reward you for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Awesome. We got it.